Happy football day! We're back here at Historic Reactor Field. Last week, State barely pulled off the win, but we unfortunately missed the game because we were all hospitalized with Norwalk virus. So this week... So this week... What the hell is going on at that next tailgate, babe? The Indian Student Union. I guess they reserved the spot next to us. God. Indian Student Union is a terrible place to meet guys because they're all in arranged marriages and I ain't no homewrecker. And also, they won't let me into their group because they say I'm a devastating representation of their people, whatever that means. What about the White Twins? They always reserve that spot. Oh, well, I heard Gerard White, you know, the more, like, fat one. Uh, sorry, um, he had, like, a mental breakdown or something. What? I know, it's really sad. God, Juju's gonna be all messed up. A human being. My dad told me that one time a bunch of black guys tried to tailgate near them. This is the exact same thing. We're all smart enough to know that African American people and East Indian people are not the same thing, right? Yeah, black people are often single and available. I just wish the white boys were here. White twins. You know, I'm not racist, babe. I tried to spearhead that anti prejudice rally in fifth grade. Yeah, but she had a speech impediment, so everyone thought it was an anti president's rally. My dad was so pissed at you. Look, all I'm saying is that the new tailgaters are gonna mess up that juju. No, I mean, everything has to be perfect or I'll die. I mean, we'll lose. But what if this is the beginning of a plot to overthrow America? Overthrow America? Look at them. <sighs> they look just like you and me. Just people. In my passive aggressive conflict resolution class, we focus on addressing problems in a way that's basically just not addressing them at all. They try to act like us and be like us and next thing you know, they're running for president. Haven't you seen Homeland? It's just like that. Spoilers! Shit's messed up, man. Monica, just go talk to him to see if they can move, huh? Just in case. Thank you. And, and to be clear, it's not a racist thing. That kind of hate would really mess with the juju. Listen, my father... Corey, if I have to hear another word about your racist dad, I am going to... have to remind you that everyone has difficult parents. My dad never would have let a woman talk to him like that. Gerard. <laughs> hey, buddy, how you feeling? Yeah, still in the old nut house, huh? Hey, listen, why don't you just come down to the tailgate here? We really need you, man. I mean, you're killing me right now. Guys, 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 they are definitely terrorists. I straight up asked them if they're terrorists and or if any of them with the burgeoning internet startup would want to date me, and they seem super offended. Classic terrorist cover up. Right? And then they have the nerve to call me a racist, which means they're stupid Indians. The worst kind of Indians. Put yourself in their shoes for a second. You called them terrorists. And also, you've got a swastika tattoo. What are you talking about? This? This is an abstract drawing of four tomahawks, our school symbol. Duh. I'm selling these on Etsy. So far, no profit. I do commend your school spirit, though, Monica. I think one of us needs to go over there and scare him with a bit of anthrax. Oh my god, why do you have anthrax? It's just powdered sugar. Why do you have powdered sugar? It's French toast day. It's French toast day? French, French toast, toast day. Kids, I mean, adults, one of whom I'm dating. Do we really think this is a good idea? I need someone to just verbally confirm with me that they do not think this is a good idea. Terry? I mean, we didn't have anthrax at last year's tailgate, so... Okay, right answer, wrong reason. Listen, Zach, we can sit here and twiddle our dicks all day, or we can go over there and win a national championship. I don't know. You don't know? This is for you, Zach. I love you, bro. Anthrax! Oh, nice prank, dum-dum. You're going downtown. On your bike? Who's asking? I'm asking. I am a real cop. I am the biking enforcement officer for Reactor Field. I have all the privileges and license and responsibilities of a regular cop, so I'm gonna cut you off right there. Stop asking, okay? It looks like a tricycle. Trike, as far as I know, there's no trike with anything above one speed. I've got two six speeds on that guy. I've also got brakes. I don't think trikes have brakes. Also, nobody pushes me. I am very excited because this is the year that I bust those tailgaters. It's not a trike. Come on! French Toast Day, 